and most exalted member of the Catholic laity of Britain. The marriage will probably take place before the coronation. Christened in a gale that blows the champagne away like spray, the Philadelphia leaves the slipway at Philadelphia on her way to the sea. The new fangled stern cutaway square is the most remarkable feature of this 10,000 ton cruiser. She's the fifth American warship of her name, built in accordance with the naval treaties. The first Philadelphia was sunk in the War of Independence. By sea, President Roosevelt sails to open the Pan-American Conference in the Argentine. Not since Woodrow Wilson went to Versailles has an American president gone abroad on a mission such as this. His landslide re-election makes it possible for him to sail away south in the cruiser Indianapolis. Flying high over this terrible bushfire in the Blue Mountains, New South Wales, 